Welcome back to Bloodthirsty Lord, but you can call me Lordy and today we're back on Paragon once again for another amazing video. In this video, we're going to talk about how Paragon and Epic Games team have brought the idea of Christmas or Winterfest to Paragon for 2016 and it's pretty bloody amazing. It's small, but it's there and it's pretty sick to see. So we're going to go through that and tell you everything that you need to know for the Christmas stuff that in game at this current moment. But before we get into this video, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe button to keep up to date with all the greatest and latest Paragon Gaming content and Paragon Gaming news. And if you haven't yet, make sure you turn on notifications by hitting that little bell button next to the subscribe button so you have the chance of becoming one of the first mates on the channel up to date with my amazing Paragon Gaming content. And as always, expect it here first. So without further ado, let's get straight into this video. So I did mention in my last video, if you go around the store and you go look at certain parts of the store, say if you're around the skins, you'll be able to see the actual snow effect in the background of the actual skin. So if we go over to Shadow Ops, you can see the little snow particles right behind him. So it's pretty sick, something subtle, something pretty nice for the actual theme of Christmas being in Paragon. So it's, I actually like it, it's pretty sick. Nothing too crazy though. Then you can go actually to the other parts of the actual game as well. If you go over to Profile Overview, and if you had car packs, there's usually snow particles in the background. You can see subtle snow particles. I've opened some car packs today, so you might see some on screen right now, which will be showcasing the snow particles around the actual car packs, and it's pretty sick. But that's still subtle things. You can also check if you go onto your actual heroes on your profile, and you can also see it there. As you can see with my new Arctic Frost skin, you can also see the snow effect right behind her. It's pretty sick. But they're all subtle little changes here and there. So there's also another change within the actual game, within the actual map, Monolith. So if you do load into Monolith, there's a pretty amazing experience. So we can go into Solarverse AI, and we'll be back with you guys in a bit to showcase you that part of the map. That is obviously under a Christmas theme. So as you can straight away see before we actually enter the match, you can see the Christmas light just hanging off the actual map around certain parts of the terrain. And obviously we had to play Rick to Old Saint Rick because it just goes so well with the theme. We don't get these basic starts just because we got nothing else to do there. And look at the actual map. So with your core or your base, you'll be able to see this Christmas effect or the Christmas lights along with the snow particles and the snow day effect on the map. So that's pretty sick. So you've got snowing effect. So they're testing out the weather uh, elements to the actual map. They did mention that within the live stream that they had the ability to change weather within the game with the new tools. And they are using it now. This is a subtle change, but it's still there and it looks pretty sick. And also with the Christmas lights, they're just hanging off everywhere. I thought these will go to lane, but I don't think they do because they don't go into lane. See, as you can see, they just stop where the actual inhibitor is and they go in and then they keep going. We're going to see where this actually goes. Because I don't think there's much Christmas changes to the map except for the snow effect. All the snow particles, aka snowing, followed by the Christmas lights, which are the exact same lights that Richtel does have on this skin right now. And they, it looks like it all comes together to the Amber Link. And it's kind of interesting, why would it come towards the Amber Link? There's so many reasons why, don't you think? Uh, but it doesn't really stand out straight away. But the reason why they're doing this, sharing is caring. Spreading the love to your teammates is obviously a good way for Christmas vibe. And with the Amber Link, you're sharing CXP with your teammates. So I'm guessing that's what the idea is behind that skin. Let's kill this Grux because it's kind of annoying. Can we get the kill? Don't run away. Come on, Miss Speed. Oh my god. Now we're not getting him. He's gone. Oh, wait, so why didn't you snipe him with the R2000 missile, man? What a fail. <laughs> but the idea of this actual thing was just sharing is caring how it looks it. Which I like it. It's pretty sick. Subtle change. Nothing too crazy. Obviously, in the future, if they do want to experiment on this even more with other events, they could go ham with these type of weather systems. Right now, it is pretty sick though. Just walking around the jungle seeing like some snow and you're just killing the green buff or the jungle buff or clearing some camps. It's pretty nice. The actual theme and the vibes I'm getting while playing this map is 100% Christmas-like, Winterfest-like. It's just spreading the cheer. And it's so amazing to actually experience that in Paragon, especially on this map, Monolith, that just came out recently. So they have been putting in some work with the weather system and some other interesting aspects because this was not mentioned anywhere at all that they would integrate a Christmas theme for Monolith or Christmas anything within Paragon. The only thing that we knew of was the Winterfell skins and those getting released today are for sale and obviously going to end at January 9th. So it's kind of interesting. Obviously, I'm excited for whatever comes next. I want to die. No. No, don't do it. Don't do it. Yes, you backed off. You got to love bots. <laughs> they just back off every time when they're about to kill you. Okay, we're going to recall here. Now we're gonna recall to the actual. We're gonna recall next to the Amber Link. I think that's better. Thumbnail. Look, you can see this. Look. Oh my God. Krampus. Is that him? Next to some Christmas lights. Next to the Amber Link. That's insane. With some snow. What? 
But either way, I love the changes. And I'm really excited for what's going to happen next with this game. If anything else intriguing does come out about Christmas or any other news does come out, because we've uploaded like, this is going to have three, a third video for tonight or fourth video. It's been insane. We've just been trying to cover as much news as possible. So there's a lot of content on my channel if you haven't watched the end. Make sure you do so because they're quite enjoyable. And some of those videos were extremely funny. So I suggest you do watch those as quick as possible. But mates, tell me your thoughts about this. What do you think about the changes on this actual map and the changes in general with the snow, the Christmas lights, and the idea of sharing is caring through the actual Amber Link? Because I found it pretty funny. So mates, tell me your thoughts and your opinions in the comment section down below. So if you did enjoy this video, show us below that smash that like button. Let's try to get 250 likes on this video. And if you make want to see more Paragon Gaming content on my channel, all you have to do is share this with your friends and hit the subscribe button to become a mate today. And that is all for this video. I will time to go, but don't you worry. We're back very soon. Hey Jazz Boys, this has answered nothing yet. There was some leaked footage of Legacy having snowmen and all that type of stuff on the actual map. If they did that with this map, oh my god, guys, that would have been bloody insane. <laughs> Saying that it feels right.